to evaluate the triple integral over the solid bounded by y square plus g square equals 36, x equals 0, g equals 0, and y equals 3x in the first octant. Since we are taking everything in the first octant, so y square plus g square is a complete circle, but we take portion of it, as you see. So the portion will be just this one from y and z axis, one fourth of the circle. What else we have? This is x axis, this is y axis, y equals 3x is a line like this. So that line actually goes here, like this. And as you see on this side, what is this one? In this case, you will see that g equals 6 and y is also 6. Is that right? So then what happens? When I have y equals 6 and this line is going, going y equals 3x, so in the domain, again, you can see for x, y, this is x, this is y. So I'm going, this is y equals 3x, and you have another y equals 6, goes like this, y equals 6. So that tells you now 6 equals 3x, so x will be equals 2 in this case. Okay, and this is my domain also in the xy plane and x limit goes from 0 to 2 so we write 0 to 2 to x the y limit now goes at the boundary here so it goes from the line 3x to 6 what happens to g the g limit we have seen it is going from xy plane to this boundary of the surface so you can find z e squared is 36 minus y squared so then z will come out as plus or minus 36 minus y squared so we can draw the picture now so it'll be just like this so we get a solid like this this one in here and also everything inside Okay, so our g goes from 0 to the square root of 36 minus y squared. Okay, so we clean the screen. Now let us do the integral. We have 0 to 2, 3x to 6. The integration of g will be 1 half. g squared limit goes from 0 to the square root of 36 minus y squared. Then we have dy dx. Plug the limit, keep your one half all the way to the left side. 0 to 2, 3x to 6. Plug the limit, you get 36 minus y squared. Limit already we have there. Integration with respect to y first, then x. Alright, so we are almost there. 0 to 2, and then the integration gives me 36y minus 1 third y to the 3, limit goes from 3x to 6, and then dx. So let us plug the limit we have there. 1 half, 0 to 2, then we have 36 times 6 minus 1 third 6 to the 3 that's the upper limit minus the lower limit is now 36 y replaced by 3x minus 1 third y replaced by 3x to the 3 and then dx so the remaining portion of this one i'll do in the calculator so in the calculator you can choose from math so my calculator is a little old but uh, we have the option here f and int finite integral so what i need here first type my function 36 times 6 so i'll type everything i have just see how we are writing 
So I'm going to math and then choose finite integral, which is option 9. Then type your function, which is 36 times 6, as you see there. Then 6 to the 3 over 3 minus now 36 times 3x. And then I have 3x to the 3 over 3. And don't forget to close the parenthesis there. And then this will be with respect to x. And then the limits are 0 to 2. And then hit enter. So you get 108. Is that right? So that's the integral on this. And divided by 2. So let me write it here. So you get 1 half. 108 which is 54 and we are done.